All right, how about a tip on a sand trap shot, the bunker shot? And of course, having enough loft on your sand wedge is really pretty important. This club has 58 degrees on it. And if you don't know what loft you have on your sand wedge, bring it into the golf shop. We can actually measure it for you. So here's the tip on the, on the sand shot. Uh, we have a little drill set up here. We have two lines. And we're going to put the, the line that's furthest from the hole in the middle of your stance. So the back line is in the middle of your stance. And the effort here is to make sure you open the club face a little bit, you aim your body a little bit to the left, and then you just take a big swing and you take all the sand out between the two lines. That's the, the big effort here. What we see people do in the sand trap is usually take too small a swing. They don't swing with enough effort. So now we'll put a ball down there. And as you get better and better with taking out the sand that is only between the two lines that are a few inches apart, then you put a ball right in between those two lines. And again, take a big enough swing. And the ball worked out pretty good. The ball came out, so it's about 10 feet from the hole. And it's just that the ball came out on a nice splash. You can see that I didn't dig into the sand because the club face was open. We had a nice little splash of sand. The ball came out plenty high. All right, I hope that helps.